find the E Boy five secret versions with versions. Hey, what's up? One I'm Cody. <laughs> I'm Nut. <laughs> and we're we're gonna find the real F Boy today. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm an F Boy. 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 <laughs>
you just wear you just wear a hat by yourself at home is a shameful experience. I don't, I'm confused. Oh you see your thighs. Oh, it has to be in front of the I believe that. I don't know. I ain't gonna lie. I don't know what the name is. I don't know what the name Does is. It Kaya is like fucked up, by the way. They gave her some of that good shit, okay? Whatever kind of drugs they gave her has her zooted out the entire day. She's currently just quietly staring at the gate. That's it. I think in front of a mirror? Yeah, because you got to look how good you look. You that's know what I'm saying? Okay, like, no, that's well, cool. Who don't in okay, front of a mirror? I right. trust him. Reverse cowgirl for sure. Okay. Doggy. I don't believe you. <laughs> no, I don't believe everything you say. <laughs> Dude, come on. <laughs> Doggy. <laughs> Doggy. I mean, it's, it's, I'm sorry, but Gabe is definitely not the fuck boy. Oh, immediately, within like 10 seconds. Yeah. <laughs> like, like, and no. I love him. I love him to death. Oh, he's awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Gabe. <laughs> Gabe. That's literally the actual fuck boy. That's it. They eliminated the fuckboy. The rest of them are virgins. <laughs> Gabe, I love you, man. I love me but too. But unfortunately, I... the doggy That's that, that came to the way. <laughs> My dog. <laughs> My dog. <laughs> Can Hassan Abi define a fuckboy? I mean, literally, there you go. A fuck, the fuckboy was determined by his high body count, low relationship, low relationship readiness score. What the fuck is this ad? Oh, it's a Nectar ad. Go to pickup line. What do you say? What's your move? How do yeah. you have sex with I that? think it all depends on the girl because you got to comment something about her looks or how she's dressed. Something different than every other dude goes. And then, depending on that, go from there. No, yeah. You know, talk to a girl. Um, get her number. Take her home to my place, you know? I don't <laughs> believe you. I don't believe you. <laughs> a close second would be... My d must be kung fu because it going haya. No. <laughs> Why doesn't it make sense? Wait, sorry. Haya? Yeah, what is that? Hi what yeah. What does that even mean? She's like, wait, you know kung fu? Yeah, yeah, I'm okay. Like, no, but my d does. My dick. <laughs> you can say this guy is one hondo p a virgin. Oh my god, dude. He is. Dude, oh my lord. Every one of these guys. Uh, it's over. What's a fuck boy, Hassan? Motherfuckers, is this chat is full of it, myself included. Shut the fuck up. Dad, it yeah. yeah, okay. Uh, Joseph. All right, for me, yeah. so let's say, like, I'm just going to paint you guys a picture real quickly. Let's say we're at the club, right? Yeah. My go-to method is the do I know you method, right? Okay, this guy is not a fuck boy and has read way too many fucking forums, all right? So let's say you're the girl. I'm trying to raise up. He, he's literally, he is straight up utilizing, like, what he has read from other virgins about how fuckboys actually operate. Now, I'm not saying he himself is like a bad person or whatever, but like it seems obvious to me that his only experience with what like uh, fuckboys are is just through uh, is through like the source material being written by other incel uh, or other virgins. Okay, I go up to you be like, okay, wait, wait. Oh. <clears throat> So, I'll go up to you and I'll be like, hey, uh, do I know you? Or like, um, I don't think so. <laughs> no? Oh, uh, did you go to my college or my church by any chance back then? Uh, church. Nailed it. He caught him because I told you he's a virgin. He's 100% he's not a fuckboy. Uh, what college did you go to? Oh, I went to uh, Pepperdine back then. Okay, double. Okay, there you go. That boy is religious, okay? Pepperdine is the one with the fat ass cross, right? Back in like a years ago. Did you uh, go there by any chance? No. No? Um, is your name Tiffany, Jasmine, or Michelle by any chance? No. No? Hmm. I swear, I've seen you before though. Anyways, my name is Joseph. What's your name? Tiffany. Tiffany. <laughs> <laughs> like I, def I did not want to sleep with you at all. Oh, yeah. No, that's so perfect. If that's yeah. your game, it like didn't, yeah. didn't work very well. Yeah. So yes. You mentioned church. Yeah. And then I also noticed you got oh, yeah, the cross course. tattoo. Yeah. I'm wondering uh, what where does religion factor in Oh it doesn't it doesn't play any role for me. But you you He's just lying, bro. Jesus is gonna hear that. Jesus hears you lying. Just letting you know. 
Kind of fucked up. Have the tattoo. That yes. seems like a very strong move. Yes, it was. Then it's like, not it's follow like, it very well. It's just like or? so. You see, this chains, right? It's to remind me that no matter how far I go into the world, I will be chained there by my go. religion. Okay, there so you I'll go. still I'm, be there. You know what I'm saying? That was good. That was so, good. So that was too good of an that answer. That was really good. Well, but that's like a lie. If that's a lie, that's a good fuckboy thing where you lie a lot. Yeah. Yeah. Whatever. Okay. True. Are you? Would you say you are manipulative? No, of course not. I like. You're a fuckboy, of course you're manipulative. Just the way I present myself and the way I talk, I, I wouldn't say I have anything I'm hiding. Isn't that a fuckboy thing though, to be like manipulative? Yeah. Well, I, I do believe- <laughs> <laughs> Bro, come on, dog. He said church. Which church do you go to? No fuckboy is going up to a, a, a honey at a nightclub and being like, hey, what's up, mama? Which church do you go to? Have you, Are you perchance- are you are you at my church for chance? Like you know what I mean? Like that's not a that's not a bar. That's not a. Well, actually, I can't manipulate. Yourself. Actually, wait, no, I am manipulative. Okay, what about you? I don't really have a pickup line, but usually you just act like you're not from. You just go up and go like this. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you, 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 you know, you dance your way into it in the club. You gotta bring it here. Come it's here, you know. Okay. To be honest, I only approach girls who look at me. So I'll be like, hey, what's your name? That's it. He's the only one that could be potentially a fuckboy. The rest of them are like, definitely not. You're giving me like theater vibes. What does that mean? Like you maybe are in plays? Oh, nah. I don't know. I'm just getting, it's like uh, the stance and like the shoes and belt and stuff. I'm giving, it's respectfully. I feel like you're playing a fuckboy in a musical. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Damn, dude. <laughs> I'm sorry, was that really mean? I didn't mean, yeah, I mean my fault. I'm trying to figure, I'm trying to make him cry. I'm also just trying to picture what that would be like. I don't know. I just, I'm trying I was... to f girls. Yeah. We're going to give you a hint. The real F boy has a relationship readiness score of 2 out of 10. And their body count is over 50. Do with that as you will. What is your exact body count? I stopped at 30, because I feel like a better answer is I don't know. How long ago was that when you stopped? A while. Okay, because she's told us it was over 50. This guy, that's a relatively decent answer. Mm -hmm. Well, because I know for sure I've slept with more than 20 women since then. 30 was a while ago. I In the four, for some five. reason I believe him. All right, but I have my eye on you. It's not something like you really <laughs> want to tell a girl that often. Yeah, but what you were telling us, because we asked you. Tell you guys. Uh, yeah. Over 50. Over 50? Yeah. <clears throat> okay. What's your longest relationship? Four months. Did you cheat? Have no. you cheated? I have not cheated, no. Virgin. The relationship thing was two out of 10, which implies like not ready. Yeah. But you were, That's you seemed like you were down. That's the relationship I've been in. How long ago was that? That was like six months ago. Interesting. Dude, they're all, dude, they already eliminated the fuckboy first round. I'm telling you. That's going to be the big reveal, I think. Okay. <clears throat> For me, 63 to be exact. I, I'm like an organized type of person, so I like to keep, <laughs> I like to keep track of it on like a notepad or no, my, you don't. No, you don't. No, I swear. I swear. <laughs> Do you have the notepad? I, I can't. It's confidential. It does have like numbers on it and like. Bro, this guy is like. Not only is he lying, but he's lying in, like, the weirdest ways. He's just, like, he's lying in ways that, like, you don't need to. You know what I mean? My notes on it and stuff. So is I, it I, notes? You're yeah, taking so notes on each hookup? Oh, I like, good, like, good, well, I, I, 8 I, I, out of I 10, pretty like, solid. No, you don't, you're not doing Oh, my God. <laughs> Extra Emily. She talked about it on the podcast. That. that would be like insane if he was. Yeah, like, once you do that. have sex, don't do that. <laughs> that would be why. Yeah, don't do that. I'm not gonna lie. I kept counting until 50 because obviously all of them are not like a 10. And she definitely is not a fuck boy. <laughs> okay. She is not a fuck girl either. You know, some of them you just kind of do get on. You like, you'd be like, Ugh. after you know, like, what am I doing with my life? So you just kind of like. I don't know. It sounds bad, bro. But that's pretty boy. It sounds bad, bro. I ain't gonna lie, but yeah, that's why I don't keep counting after that. And you? Uh, you? When I turned 25, I honestly stopped counting. Oh my God, you? that's fake. I'm 32. You look great for 32. Nah, yeah, sure. seriously. Yeah. Damn. Must be all the sex you're having. Yeah. 
motherfucker, his name is Hassan, he's 32. What's happening here? Wait, why would you stop at a certain age? Like, <sighs> that doesn't make sense either, okay? It's literally Hassan. No, it's not. Get the fuck out of here. Uh, how dare you? No, this dude is not a fuckboy either. I'm telling you, the first guy was the fuckboy. I kind of agree with what he said. Like, I get depressed after I have But why would that coincide with <laughs> the depressed? age you are yeah. and not the amount of people why you have doing sex it? with? What? Sorry. He said he gets depressed after he has sex. I'm like, why do you keep, why do you <laughs> stop doing it so much? Why are you doing it? <laughs> it sounds like you should, sounds sounds like like you should be a virgin, dude. <laughs> I mean, I feel like... Yeah, okay, so let's get rid of them. Yeah? Okay. Three, two, one. I wish you sex in the future. Yes. Last round. I think we got this in the bag. Yeah, I'm probably just gonna nail it. Describe your best hookup story. Um, we were at the club late night, 2.30. It opened up a little bit later, then we went to an after party. And it was one of those crazy after parties where people were just doing coke in the bathroom and stuff, but I found a different bathroom. And me and Shorty went down there, went crazy. Went home, slept in my own bed, never talked to her again. Okay. Eh, made up. Let me tell you something, okay? Every single part of this, like, I can't, I don't know if you guys can, like, figure this out from just, like, hearing them. But they, it's just, it's so, no, it's not descriptive at all. No, you're actually wrong. It's not that it's too descriptive. It's the exact opposite. He is living out a fantasy of a movie. Okay. First of all, the idea that he's like, oh, there's like Coke. Everybody's doing, it's a crazy after party where everyone's doing Coke in the bathroom. Eh, wrong. In a lot of those after parties, ain't nobody's doing Coke in the bathroom. They're doing coke right outside, okay? Right on the fucking middle of the goddamn house. That's the whole point of a fucking after party, okay? It's only in the movies where you're like, oh, people are just like secretly doing coke in the bathroom. Fuck that. Everybody in the after party is doing coke out in the open. Get the fuck out of here. Uh, that's number one. Number two, he's like, oh, but I found one of the bathrooms where they weren't doing coke. And then me and Shorty just had sex. Like, okay, dude, no, not happening. That's also fake. The only time you do coke at the bathroom is at the club, usually. Unless you could just, like, sneak it, sneak a key bump at the table or something. But regardless, regardless, okay, the idea, after party at a club, not at a house. No, he said he, he went to an after party at a house, I thought. After the club, he went to an after party. That's, like, the best of all worlds. This one girl, I feel like, because we have emotional connection. And he's like, oh, yeah, we didn't even talk again. It's like, there's... There are no signifiers here. There's Describe nothing there. Describe your best hookup story. This is like the worst hookup story of all time. What? Okay, you fucked a girl in a bathroom. That's so dumb. Like, there's there's nothing unique about this story. Um, we were at the club late night, two thirty. It opened up a little bit later than we went to an after party. Yeah. See, they were at the club. They went to an after party. And it was one of those crazy after parties where people were just doing coke in the bathroom and stuff. But I found it. Yeah, it's one of those crazy after parties where people are doing coke in the bathrooms. Yeah, I was right. I, I nailed it. No. Different bathroom. And me and Shorty went down there, went crazy. Went home, slept in my own bed, never talked to her again. That's like the best of all worlds. This one girl, I feel like... Cause yeah, I'm such a fuck boy. I love having sex with women and never talking to them again. No, this guy, 100% nice guy, virgin, and is just like playing out the role is obvious. Worst after party I've ever been to was everyone using plates to do coke and pizza got delivered and I had to eat pizza off rip boxes because there were no more plates left. Acting like any of this is crazy automatic uh, is automatic faking it. Yes. We have emotional connection. It was a real fuckboy is you? Yeah, yeah, no shit, dude. What do you mean? Come like on. no wild crazy ass story. I think I think that was love, honestly. That was like the best time for me because and it didn't feel like every fucking time we had uh, sex with another person. It felt like real love. And I feel like that's anyone who's had sex has had a risky public sex story. And that's probably what you'd be talking about. Like, no, not everyone that's had sex has had a risky uh, public sex story. But like, the point is, it's dumb as fuck to, uh, I mean, not as dumb as fuck. It's just like, it's not how you would tell that story.
That's the best one for me because everybody else is do the same shit. I can't and tell if that's a good answer or a bad answer. I, I'm sorry, like, but that's like, true? I it's, it's crazy. That I don't is know. true. That's real. Yeah. But like love, I feel like the best ones is like the love ones. I don't know. How like, long was that relationship? That, it wasn't even a relationship. It was a situation ship. Jesus married bros if not everyone's a sex offender. What? Dude, I don't even know how I would describe best hookup story. It's all sex. It's all good. What the fuck? Uh, this chatter is funny. Tell your story. I, dude, I don't have any stories. I'm a virgin. The fuck do you mean? I don't have any stories. I just, I lie about having sex. I've never had it. Lines up right with the two relationship Come score. On, Interesting. Anybody doing a relationship now? All right, man. What's your... <laughs> what's your... Uh, <laughs> no. Not all sex is good sex, you virgin. Uh, sex is, especially for guys, I think. Sex is like pizza, you know? Even the microwavable shitty version is still pizza. So it's not, like, terrible, you know? I'll, I'll, I'd rather have it than not, okay? Um, But, you know, some are particularly good. Uh, so one time, me and this girl were walking home. Mm -hmm. This was in New York. And then we have, like, a lot of alleyways. Mm -hmm. And there was a chair in the alley. We know your story is the one with the dog that scared you out of the bedroom. That wasn't a good story. That was a bad one that I couldn't finish. So that was actually a bad sex story. And much like pizza, it still was very enjoyable, but I didn't, you know, eat to completion. So I was left very hungry afterwards. But the pizza that I did have, the sex that I did have at that moment, very good. Other way, and she's like, let me suck your d <laughs> What? And I'm like, wait, what? Me and this girl were walking home. Mm -hmm. This was in New York. And then we have like a lot of alleyways. Mm -hmm. And there was a chair in the alleyway, and she's like, let me suck your d <laughs> What? And I'm like, oh, f it. You got your dick sucked on a chair in an alleyway? Yeah. Why? <laughs> I mean, the adrenaline? I don't know. Was, you it didn't just have, felt good. Was there nowhere else, like, more comfortable? She just Having really wanted to do something about that alley. She just yeah. like, I really... He's, he's... This is believable. That's not as fake. Like... That's not as fake as the other ones. I still don't believe him, though. I don't, I, like I said, I think the, the only one that wasn't a virgin is the first one that they eliminated, foolishly. Really want to suck your right now. New York City does not have alleyways, broski. You freaking her where? Yeah, that's the other thing, though. There's no alleyways, right? I mean, that's why all the trash is fucking outside. There's not a lot of, there's not a lot of alleyways in New York City. There are alleyways in the parts of the boroughs. Oh, maybe he's talking about that. But Manhattan, Manhattan, there are no alleyways. There are lots of alleyways in New York City. No. No. The whole point is, I mean, there are some, but like, it's not, it's, it's not like a, it's not like a normal city where there's alleyways everywhere. The entire reason. Okay. Okay. Here's the thing. You know how when you go to New York, the trash is always on the fucking curb and you're like, wow, this is disgusting and gross. Why is the trash on the curb? I don't understand. It's because New York is densely slammed and doesn't have alleyways. Because in most cities, we take for granted the concept of alleyways where you have all of the fucking trash in a massive receptacle that holds all the trash. That's, of course, Manhattan, obviously. I don't know. Maybe Brooklyn is different. I have not really paid attention, but, but that is the major reason why there's so much trash on the motherfucking, uh, on the, on the streets. Land is expensive in New York city. Who would just be like, yeah, let's just give up prime real estate for the foot traffic. What do you mean? Chicago has alleyways. Most cities have alleyways. Most cities with prime real estate have alleyways. What the fuck? <laughs> Stick to New Jersey, man. In this alleyway. On that chair. What time of day was it? It was like at midnight. Oh, okay. I was at midnight. Yeah. Okay, I thought no, it was no. midnight. So I was, was thinking like people like 3 walking p.m. around. No, 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 no. Was it near your house? Yeah, it's bullshit. We were we were coming home from the club, so. Were you like part of the problem is the definition of alleyways? There are underground alcoves that serve as alleys. For example, in downtown Manhattan, there are courtyards. For example, in Brooklyn. Kind of close to home. No. In your I home. Don't, I don't take girls home. No. I usually go to their house. I don't like to like people know where I live. It's like, I need an exit plan. What?
Oh, uh, fake. Okay, I'm telling you, I'm calling it. Is the first guy that they eliminated? That was the only okay. one that wasn't okay. a virgin. Or every single person lied. Literally, whoever claimed that they were actually a fuck boy lied about being a fuck boy in this what? video. Right. How does sex feel? <laughs> <laughs> How does sex feel? I'll tie your head. Just say it. I mean, amazing. Sex yeah, is always yeah. good. Okay. Good. Uh -huh. Sex is good if it's with the right person. It's like love. Okay. Mm. What? What's Bro, this guy's not a fuck boy. He's like, he can't even fake being a fuckboy, Jesus Christ. That's what the love stuff yeah, now, all of a sudden. What is happening? Like, I don't know. What You're happened? throwing us off now. Well, it ain't sex if it ain't love. I'm, sorry. I'm so confused. I, okay. How does um, sex feel? To be honest, like, pretty numb. What? what? Numb? Okay. <laughs> he thinks that guy, they're all faking it. They're all faking it. Oh my God, numb? Okay, bro, you're ace. Sad, you might better switch did it we already mess it up? I can't, okay. <laughs> yeah, they oh, right. uh, yeah, they did. They did mess it up. They did. They messed it up. The first guy that they eliminated was the guy. Okay, wait. Uh, what does pussy taste like? Yeah, what does it taste like? Acid. I mean, acid. It usually pretty what did good. You say? It did you say acid? It acid? It depends. Yeah, that, the pH balances, bro. I had one girl, bro. That shit was, I'm, that, I'm sorry. I'm about to say, she must be drinking too much soda no, but or something. Okay, this is good, though, because I thought the boy would be like, it's gross. I hate it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you're saying it tastes like acid. No, I'm saying some, because you got different girls. Like, some taste good and some pH. Girl, I love? Oh, her is good. I ain't gonna cap. <laughs> I wouldn't love her if her s*** ain't, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I don't eat every girl out, you know what I'm saying? You gotta get to that <laughs> position, you feel yeah. me? You can't right. eat shorty out first night after a club, that's crazy. Or right. at least shower first, because I don't want to be down there, you know what I'm saying? Tyson. But. Bro said acid, dude. That's a yeast infection. The fuck? He's not wrong, man. Oh, a lot of Mr. Mr. Plays Wow too much. Classic. Classic Mr. Pussy Getter over here. Oh my god, this is so irreparably maidenless. Every part of this, okay? No, there's less acidic with yeast. In, there are less acidic with the yeast infections. Acidity keeps the yeast at bay. I've never eaten a pussy with a yeast infection, so I can't tell you what it tastes like with a yeast infection. Because it smells. It smells a very certain way. So that smell to me in my fucking lizard brain goes, oh, don't eat this. Okay? After you f a couple times, then for sure. Okay? And? Like salt. Like salt. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> that pH balance must be way off. This has this round has <laughs> completely destroyed what I thought the answer was gonna be. I have no idea now. I'm torn. I yeah. I think I'm gonna redo mine. I'm gonna you think do, so? do the same answer. All right. Three, two. You ain't a munch. No, I am a munch. One hundred percent. Don't even play with me. One. Pussy tastes like a battery or a coin. No, it doesn't. What the fuck are you talking about? Maybe if she's on her period. What is happening? Have you guys ever eaten pussy? What the fuck? Okay. Pussy tastes great. That's it. And it differs from person to person. But, I mean, fresh out of the shower, it tastes like nothing. It just tastes like skin. That's it. Um, you know, if it's a, it's a, a hot summer's day, there's a little bit of a, there's a, there might be a little bit of a, of a scent, but nothing like too crazy. Just a little seasoning, you know? I don't know why people say, oh, it smells like tuna. Okay, yeah, it doesn't, like, that's not normal. That's crazy that they think that that's the fuck boy. He is not Are you ready boy. to find out your relationship readiness score? Please download the Nectar app. If the lights turn green, you got it right. If the lights turn red, you got it wrong. All right, on the count of three. It's wrong. Three, two, one. It's wrong what? as fuck, bro. I'm telling you, it's the it's the dude in the blue. God, I, oh, Lawrence, God, <laughs> God. <laughs> I'll watch some of these videos sometimes. I'll be like, how do you not? This is so obvious. Same. And then, yeah. Bro, I had you on in the car. I'm giving my coworker a ride, and you're over here giving box munching taste descriptions. Why are you fucking? Uh, you better be stopping at a red light, big homie. Okay, big dog, you shouldn't be fucking 
texting and driving. It's and way harder when you're actually doing it. I feel like, I, yeah, I feel like I blew it. <laughs> if it's you, I'm gonna be so. Mad. I know, dude. <laughs> I know. <laughs> yeah, the giggling before. <laughs> it's it's him. If you step forward, I'm gonna freak out. I will freak out. <laughs> the real F boy, please step forward and share a little bit about yourself. All right, here we go. Three, if it's not him, it's because I didn't get two, to see a lot of it, but the other ones are one. fucking definitely versions. <laughs> no shot. This dude is lying about a story. No. No. He's lying. That was 100% a lie. I stand on it. He's lying. His, his after party story, fake. Told you he fucks? Yeah, because y'all are fucking virgins too. That's why... You Dude, stop. Dude, that story was absolutely fake. The only real thing he said was that he stopped counting after 30, which is fair. Uh, I have done that as well. But having said that, the story that he told is 100p fake. Yeah, we went to a party, crazy after party, coke party. Wouldn't a fuck boy lie about a story like that? No. Oh, man. I'm gonna let you walk out, man. Dude, if you walked out, I would have freaked out, dude. I might have left. This, I might have left. I might have left. <laughs> That's, I knew it though. That sucks. He, he wrote down. Him? He wrote your name down. I wrote your name down. Oh, yeah, you had it right in the first he half, right. man. I was worried about that. Man. I thought about that in the moment. It's like, I don't mean to be an F boy for real. I just love multiple girls at the same time. <laughs> We're so dumb. <laughs> you know what I mean? We're so dumb. He's a lover. Like, I love, like I'm what? a lover. Do you have a Turn hickey? your head? Exactly. Probably. Is that a hickey? Uh, no, no, that's probably just <laughs> actually. <laughs> it could be, though. Your relationship readiness score was a two. Two? Ah, that was a shock to me, too. I said two as a score, but I get it, though. You know, in a relationship, you really got to give 50-50, but also give sometimes 90 and sometimes 70. You got destroyed. You fake talk politics better. 70. I don't got that in me right now. Over 50, that's unfortunate, but real. Um, <laughs> Going to keep the count going, not know. So who knows so you're cool, what we're you're at. good with, with your ways and your He's not a virgin, but I don't think he's uh, he he told the real story with the after party. Oh yeah, I'm fine with okay, it. Yeah. Yeah, I'll find love one day, you know. You sell any here. courses? Uh, anytime, bro. I got you. You you know courses. <laughs> can we can we ask <laughs> can we ask why the rest of them are virgins? Yes, you may. Okay, why are you a virgin? Uh I'm young, I'm nineteen. Your score out of ten was a five. Yeah, I mean, that seems accurate. Maybe if I meet a girl, I'll shape up. Um, I'm, I'm, I get shy. Man, it's, it's an anxiety. So it's not a religion thing. Yeah. No, it's not. Okay. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah. Interesting. And you scored an eight out of 10. Mm -hmm. What's your reaction to that? Yeah, I believe I'm, I'm waiting and searching for the one. Um, but so far, I haven't found that person yet. You scored out of 10, a nine. Yeah. I'm not afraid to get into a relationship and I will give it my all. I just gotta find that one, you know? And I wanna find somebody who's a virgin like me. I don't wanna, you know, so we both can be so tied. I'm religious. Okay. I'm yeah. very religious. So your score was actually a three. Right now, my focus is my career. I'm an entrepreneur. I do e commerce, drop shipping, all that. Excuse me, it's my turn now? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the thing, my upbringing was so unstable and so chaotic that I didn't have time to think about anything but survival. You feel me? Because I grew up in the hood, I didn't have time to think about it, but now I'm like at a point in my life where I know what I want and I know what I'm working for, and I, and I don't want to compromise that for uh, anything right now. Any right. closing Let's words you'd like to say, gentlemen? Cody, Nut. Uh, what do you, do you have any words? Uh, doggy. Let's see. Oh yeah. You see it? See, this is what being a, a virgin gets you. You know what I'm saying? It was good with y'all. I'm a Damn, he's doing the money spread with the dollar bills.